Hey guys, it's Andrea. I'm super excited about it. I got a new pattern that I ordered. This is from Knot and Thread. I saw these cutie, cutie patchwork duffel bags advertised on Instagram. I had to go in and order. Of course, they have PDF patterns too. I like a pattern in hand, so I waited for the paper edition to come out. This cost me $15.88 shipping tax and all. Of course, if you do the PDF, it's cheaper because you're not paying shipping. I'll link Knot and Thread down below. It did come in a little bag. I just took it out so it wouldn't be so shiny for y'all. And I got my little receipt here that they signed. Thank you, Andrea, Grace, and Kate. That's a nice personal touch. Because this pattern is by Caitlin Howell. Now, you can make these patchwork duffels. The bag dimensions are 12 inches high, 20 and a half inches wide, and nine inches deep. You can make a one fabric version or a patchwork version, and it has the instructions, um, fabric requirements for each. For the patchwork, we're gonna need 12 fat eighths or three and a half inch scraps. I'm super excited about making this. And of course, she said you can um, use different things to line it. If you want it to be stiffer, use, you know, soft and stable. Stable. If you want it to be a floppier bag, you could just use regular binding. I have made bags before. Um, I've made... I've made three big bags before. I've posted them all on my Sew and Tells. If you guys want to check out my Sew and Tell playlist, it has everything basically I've ever made on there, including those bags. I've never made a duffel though. Oh, here's yeah, here's a picture of the solid, the one pat, the one fabric, and here's the patchwork. What do y'all think? It says, um, yeah, for the patchwork, I told you what you need. If you're doing a one fabric version, you need a yard. And then you need a yard of lining. Oh, she did have a little finishing kit for sale, too. I don't know why I didn't go ahead and order that. Where you could get the stuff to make the handles and the zipper pulls. Why did not order that? I don't know why Dingleberry Dut Butt didn't order that. But yeah, she had finishing kits. You could either get the, the handles where you cover it in your own fabric or the handles that are just, you know, the woven stuff. And then she had the 30 inch double zip, double pull zippers and, you know, the hardware and the soft, I think the soft and stable. I'm probably going to have to go back and order that now. I don't know why I didn't. Anyway, what do y'all think? Give me a thumbs up if you like the video, guys. Uh, when I make this, one of these days, I'll be sure and put it on my sew and tells to show y'all too. I'll see you at the next one.